hey lovelies welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Cynthia Elewa thank you so much for stopping by and consider subscribing okay let's be family if you're my returning subscriber thank you guys so much for coming back to watch you guys are the real MVP okay all right let's get right into the video so on today's video as you may have seen from the thumbnail this is a hair video and I'm gonna be showing you guys how to trim your own natural hair if you're wondering why I'm looking like a typical African mom then you know that it's because I'm using this silk, silk scarf to you know tie my hair just to let moisture sit in I don't want my hair drying out because my hair dries out quickly so yeah I just want to trim my hair because I want to put it in a protective hairstyle so it's been a very long time I trimmed my hair I think since last year was the last time I trimmed my hair since this year I haven't trimmed my hair and my ends are really really getting bad so I decided to do this today you know because it's better to trim your hair it's very important to trim your hair because the more you trim your hair the more you the more you give it that boost to grow but if you don't trim it the ends will just be you know getting in and in. before you know it your hair your entire hair is totally bad so yeah i'm gonna be doing that right now showing you guys how to trim your natural hair okay let's get right into this Do you have a moment in this very second i know you feel the beat so this is my natural fussy hair and this is how it's looking as you can see it's very very clean so i decided to twist it and let it stay so now what i'm gonna be doing is i'm not gonna loosen my whole hair just for this video no it's gonna be too much it's gonna be overwhelming my hair dries out quickly if i do that i won't be able to manage it <laughs> so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna be opening it one by one so after trimming each part, I'm just going to retwist it back and leave it, you know, as it is. So I'm going to start with this part, right? So I have some hair clips. I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, clip any one that is obstructing my way. So I'll clip this once. And also these ones so that I'll just see my way and know what I'm doing here the first thing I want to do is use my big tooth comb and just comb it out I haven't been taking good care of my hair at all seriously I haven't and it's really affecting my hair so I have to do something about it as you can see the ends are looking really bad and it's causing my hair to break out I have a lot of breakout guys so I'm gonna just comb this out after doing that I'm gonna divide this hair into two and I'm also gonna clip the upper part so that I'll see what I'm working with I'm gonna clip this So I'm going to be working with this section right here. So it's important that you section your hair. That way it will be very easy for you to manage when you're trimming it. Because if you just leave it like that, I mean, it's not going to make sense. So guys, this is my hair. Okay, after combing it out, you can see. You can see the ends that they're looking really bad. I'm sure you can see because the background is white. So... You want to trace it with your index finger and your middle finger you just trace and trace when you see where it's feeling coarse and where it looks like it's thinning out because looking at it from here is full but coming to this end you will see that it's thin and transparent look at it from here to here you can see and this is about maybe an inch or two inches see very bad very very bad so I'm gonna be trimming it out 
don't be afraid to cut your to trim your hair guys because just like money you feel like when you give it out it's gonna finish no more will come so it's the same with your hair when you cut it out it will grow back and even grow tremendously and you will be so glad that you did so i'm just gonna trim this out from here It's been long, I've been wanting to trim my hair since this year, but I haven't had the chance. So I'm going to do this. And I'm going to comb it again. Now using a smaller comb. Just to be sure. I trimmed it out very well. So I'll still have to trace. You can see that. So I'm gonna trim it out. So as you can see that is done I trimmed that quite a lot because the breakage was just coming up to to my you know to the middle of my hair uh, twist it back and leave it as it was okay now that's a breath of fresh air because <laughs> uh, I'm happy I'm doing this don't be scared to trim your hair. When you trim it, when you trim it, you're giving it an avenue to, you know, grow. Now look at how it's looking. Compared to the tip of this one, you see this one is thinning out. Now compare it with this. I'm not even sure I'm, you are seeing what I'm doing. Okay, let me do this. So compare this tip, okay? You can see how it's looking. You see where it's called. Compare it with this. You see the thickness right there now. Here is thinned out and here is not. It's looking okay now. So yeah. So this was what I was able to trim out. This was the much I trimmed out as you can see so I'm just gonna continue go over to the next one so going over to the next one I'm, I'm still gonna be doing the same thing I'm gonna comb it out so I heard it's not good to use uh, a scissors that you use literally for everything to cut your hair or trim your hair actually trim your hair so it's not good to use the scissors now you guys can see the bad ends right here see you see the thickness where it stopped let me do this again Even from the sound, you can know that it's just breaking. It's breaking. So if you guys know a good product that I should use on my hair that will stop breakage, please let me know at the comment section. So from here, I'm going to trim, trim out this one. Yeah. I'm going to comb it out again. As you can see it's looking nice but I'm gonna try to see if there are any more thing I need to do there okay this one looks pretty much okay but I'm just gonna trim it out a bit Okay, 
there you have it so I'm going I will just uh, twist it back and leave it as it is so guys you are not to use a a scissors or shear that you use literally for everything to trim your hair my head is not good i don't know actually which you know why it's not good the reason i don't know but that's what i heard and i think it's better safe than sorry so i'm just gonna go ahead and do the back part and i will show you the front So guys, finally, this is the last one. So I'm just gonna comb this out. And I'm gonna divide it into two. So I'll just keep this one. And I'll work with this. Comb it out again. I'm gonna be using a smaller comb. Then I'm gonna check for the bad ends. over to the last one this is a very 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 last one so I'm gonna repeat the same and this and I'm gonna trace it there it is Twist it.
very very tiny part of it yeah now it's burnt okay so this is it guys I'm done trimming all the hair and this is what they're looking like I know they might look short right now but with time you will see that this trimming is gonna help my hair very much it's gonna help it now everything is looking very nice blonde and very nice so yeah this is it for this tutorial so this is the amount of hair that I trimmed out of my entire hair as you can see you may see much right now but I don't really mind because it's been a very long time I trimmed my hair so yeah this is it These are the bad, bad, bad ends. Really bad ends. This is it on how to trim your hair. This is the end of this video. If you find it interesting, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to share. Okay, guys. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye, guys.